right, it's time now for today's tech check. We're going to look at uh, the phone wars. CNBC reporting that Google is getting ready to unveil a fo foldable pixel phone. Deidre Bosa has the details. Hi, Deidre. So, Tyler, maybe phone wars on the surface, but really, this isn't much of a battle. Google's smartphone business, it's a mere blip in terms of market share in North America. It has about 2% globally. It doesn't even register. So this is less about a $1,700 flip smartphone. It's more about the war being waged over search, which is still the core of Google's business. And that is where Android comes in. Google's operating system makes up more than 70% of global mobile operating systems. It's the OS of choice for basically any phone that is not an iPhone. That, in turn, creates the moat around search, one of the best business models in history. So Google investing more in Pixel phones, that may actually be part of protecting that ecosystem at a time when the cracks are starting to show, guys. We talk all the time about, even if it's minor right now, but the idea that Bing could eventually disrupt Google's dominance of the market with ChatGPT. I think you were talking the other day about how much money Google pays to be the default search um, engine on Apple phones. I was stunned yeah. to hear that. It's huge. <laughs> that was from that New York Times article. We knew that it was over $10 billion. They estimated it at $20 billion in this current iteration. That contract, by the way, is allegedly up soon. So, yes, Google pays that much money. That's what it is worth to the company to keep that hold. I talked about how Google searches on all the Android phones, but it's also on all the iOS phones, the Apple operating system phones, too. And it pays a pretty penny to have that placement. And, again, just goes back to all about protecting that moat around search.